What is the difference between heart attack, cardiac arrest and heart failure? We have all heard the terms and each one signifies a health crisis involving the heart. But heart attack, cardiac arrest and heart failure are not the same. They are three different problems with radically different causes and treatments. Heart attack. During a heart attack, blood flow to the heart is blocked, often by a blood clot or a buildup of plaque in the arteries. Not everyone has the same symptoms. Some people have chest pain or shortness of breath or they feel tired days or weeks before the heart attack. During a heart attack, you may feel pain in the middle of the chest that can spread to the back, jaw or arms. Or you may feel pain in these places and not in your chest. Cardiac arrest. In cardiac arrest, the heart stops beating and needs to be restarted. Cardiac arrest is an electrical problem triggered by a disruption of heart's rhythm. Most heart attacks do not lead to cardiac arrest. However, when cardiac arrest happens, a heart attack is a common cause. Because cardiac arrest stops the heart from beating, the brain, lungs and other organs do not get the blood and oxygen they need. Cardiac arrest can lead to death within minutes if not treated. Whereas heart failure occurs when the heart muscles fails to pump as much blood as the body needs. It is usually a long-term chronic condition but it may come on suddenly. In people with heart failure, the heart does not pump normally causing the hormone and nervous system to compensate for the lack of blood. The body may raise blood pressure making the heart beat faster and causing it to hold on to salt and water. If this retrained fluid builds up, the condition is called congestive heart failure. Thank you so much for watching this video.